Good evening, everyone. For this speech, I kind of wrote a little premise of how I want to follow along, so the greeting nailed it. <laughs> for anyone who doesn't know me, my name's Brad Pitt. I'm a very wealthy, successful actor. For any of those who do know me, it's really me, Chuck's cousin, Louis Lobello. First joke, killed it. <laughs> to all the family and friends, firstly, let me thank everyone for coming out tonight on behalf of Chuck and Elisa. Most of you look amazing. <laughs> ah, just kidding. Less than most look amazing. Second joke, killed it. <laughs> to the mothers, Camille and Chev, both of you look absolutely stunning. Louis, stay away from a joke on this one. <laughs> Delivered. <laughs> and to the crowd, everyone, thank you for coming out. Sincerely, uh, you guys do look amazing. Be sincere to the crowd to win hearts. <laughs> Crush it. <laughs> Alyssa, you look absolutely... Alyssa, sorry. Uh, I said I wasn't going to do it, and I did it, sorry. You look absolutely amazing. Uh, to the groomsmen, I especially thank you guys for being there for my cousin uh, when I was so far away. He's been like a brother to me, so thank you guys. What a weekend in Atlantic City, wasn't it? <laughs> Nothing happens. It was just a really good weekend. Move on. Okay. Well, here we are. Let me start with Elisa, the new Mrs. Lobello. Somehow, Charlie managed to find a girl so gorgeous that your mother had to make a duplicate. <laughs> Literally, there's two of them. They're a twin. I honestly have never met a more lovely, caring, tolerant, tolerant, foul-mouthed girl in my life. <laughs> Throw an ad lib. Two nights ago, Lisa threatened to stab me with a safety pin if I didn't shut up. Fourth joke. Nailed it. Ah, uh, but sincerely, you are the only girl I've known for Chuck since he's been 15 or 16. And uh, it's hard to welcome you to our family just because you've been part of it so, for so long. But it's nice to have your name legally on paper and attached to half the oil business. <laughs> and now, Mr. Lobello, what can I say? Smart, handsome, beautiful child, well-educated, but enough about me. I'm here to talk about Charlie. <laughs> Fifth joke, not so funny. <laughs> but seriously, uh, when Chuck asked me to be the best man, he did it in uh, true Chuck fashion. I got a phone call uh, about two in the afternoon. Yo, Lou, I'm getting married. Uh, I'm pretty much the man, so if you can make it to my wedding, you can be the best man. Uh, that would be great. <laughs> I said, uh, well, what day? He's like, I don't know, dude. Call me later. <laughs> and I did, and I agreed, and I said, okay, you tell me when it is, and I'll be there. Six joke. Nailed it. <laughs> uh, but frankly, he was my first friend. I was a lonely child, so the moment he was born, I pegged him as my best friend. <laughs> And 26 years later, we've never gone a day without talking, so... Uh, he's been a better brother than I could have ever asked for. We've laughed together, we've cried together, we've fought together. Don't get emotional. <laughs> Did not crush it. Turn page. And we've been best friends for 26 years, so... 
I love you. I've watched them grow up. I taught them to drive in my grandpa's car at night on the highway with cops rolling around when he was 13 years old. So I rain down as the cool cousin. So any cousins out there, if you need to learn how to drive and you're under 15, come on over. Uh, but Charlie, to be honest, I'm proud of you. I'm proud to call you my brother. I'm proud to call you my best friend. And I love you. Okay, Louis, I mean Brad Pitt, you absolutely nailed your speech. So grab your champagne glass and ask the crowd to kindly raise their champagne glasses. Oh, Jesus, what the hell just came out of the mouth? Grab your champagne glasses and raise them high in a toast. To Chuck and Elisa, I couldn't have asked for a two better group of people. Let's get this night started. Cheers! One more time, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together nice and loud for Louie, Amanda, and Mike. Beautiful job, beautiful coast. We all have it. At this time, I'd like to ask everyone to please remain at your tables as your first course is on the table. The wonderful staff here. The South Bay Battle.